to draw your attention to something that gets overlooked a lot, which is really serious for our country, for our democracy, and for workers' rights. I need to talk about the Tory attack on democracy via dodgy trade deals. I'm talking about TTIP, I'm talking about CETA, the Comprehensive Economic Trade Agreement between the EU and Canada. Behind our backs, without telling anybody about it, our government has signed us up to CETA, the Comprehensive Economic Trade Agreement between the EU and Canada. This is a this will lock in supranational legislation that reduces existing safeguards on workers' rights, food standards, public services and the environment. And it allows large corporations to undermine the legislative process in the UK. The Tory government is, is supposedly so hostile to Europe, but it's signed us up to, to CETA. In doing so, it's overriding the parliamentary European Scrutiny Committee's block against the implement, provisional implementation of CETA, and also its full application. Despite the resolution of the House on the 17th of November 1998, which prohibits ministers from giving agreement to decisions in the European Council while they are still under scrutiny. While attacking the lack of democracy in Europe, the Tory government has still not allowed the UK Parliament a vote or even a full debate on CETA before signing us up to it in February 2017. In the name of sovereignty, the Tory government wants to leave the supranational European Court of Justice, which protects our human rights. And yet CETA includes a supranational multilateral investment court, aka ISDS court, a corporate court which allows large corporations to sue national governments if legislation protective of our rights threatens their profits. The Tories want to adopt a free market approach to trade deals after Brexit, leading to fewer safeguards for public services, workers' rights, food safety and the environment, and abandoning the EU's precautionary principle that makes products safe before going on sale to the public, instead of waiting for a health and safety disaster to happen. And we know what happens, don't we, looking at Grenfell. The Tories have passed preparatory legislation for these new trade deals by CETA, the Deregulation Act in 2015 that makes profit a compulsory part of the regulatory practice, including within the NHS, the Infrastructure Act 2015 that allows government access to land anywhere, e.g. for fracking, overriding local council or residence objections. Also in 2011, they amended an act thereby preventing Parliament having a veto on trade deals, unlike every other EU member state. So if you want to find out more about these dodgy trade deals, join our email list and Facebook page to receive updates and build a stronger movement. Action, TTIP, at list, riseup.net, uh, Facebook, no CETA, thank you. So no CETA, Facebook, that's it. Okay guys, thank you so much. Thank you very much to the previous speaker.